today, this morning, received their certificates as well, and we hope to um, work constructively uh, in, a, in a, a manner that uh, is truly empowering uh, in terms of knowledge sharing and, and bringing in the best practices to bear on the breakfast conversation and meditation. And it is by engaging such diverse groups like these that the transformative change envisioned by the new climate economy can be achieved. To begin with, you can design better cities, compact and connected cities, with better urban planning and transport systems. We could save three trillion over the next 15 years if we build our cities in a smart way. That would create better places to live in and produce less carbon pollution than causes climate change. Using new agricultural as the cost of wind and solar power continues to fall, low carbon energy is becoming the smart choice to meet energy demand. Most fast growing economies can already achieve more than a quarter of their new energy needs from renewable sources. And the best part? The investments needed to shift to a low carbon economy are almost the same as those investments will make anyway. Today's technological advances are already creating opportunities for employment and economic growth while reducing climate risks. And if government leaders pursue smart policies, they will accelerate these changes. These climate economy dot report. For years we've been told that we cannot person, which is the original and the authentic one. But the translated one is what is being launched today, uh, in addition to the original English person that was launched in New York uh, a few weeks ago. Uh, with that, let me uh, invite Professor Michael Jacobs, who is a senior advisor to the Global Commission, to kindly present uh, on the subject of the report. And if you can read it at the same time, then, uh, then you can get a little bit of entertainment uh, through that version. Um, I'm here on behalf of the team, the core team. Uh, how can you improve growth in the global community on a very uh, steeply rising trajectory and we need to change it? And there is a 15 year window, the next 15 years, the period until 2030, in which this task has to be done. Because if it's not done over the next 15 years, we will lock in emissions which will also reduce the emissions that are caused by climate change. And these were broadly speaking.
also inisiatif yang mencari mekanisme uh, aksi-aksi yang bisa dilakukan guna uh, mencapai kemajuan ekonomi negara-negara uh, namun juga dengan menghindari uh, efek dari perubahan iklim La alta rigurosidad científica y académica con que se realizó el deporte de new climate economic mejor crecimiento mejor clima el compromiso de todos los países y organizaciones que forman la Comisión Global sobre la Economía y el Clima contribuyen a garantizar que la socialización y divulgación del reporte sirva de soporte para que los diferentes actores políticos la base eficaz de los recursos, la inversión en proyectos con bajos niveles de emisión de carbono y el desarrollo tecnológico, tanto en las ciudades como en la racionalización del uso de la tierra y en los sistemas de generación y usos energéticos deben menggunakan research yang efektif dan investasi guna mencapai emisi karbon yang yang rendah serta penggunaan teknologi yang berkembang baik itu di kota-kota mencapai pertumbuhan yang stabil dan equitatif con las generaciones venideras, con el compromiso político de todos nosotros, porque a todos nos afecta hoy y en el futuro. Tantangan yang besar adalah tidak hanya untuk pencapaian dari report tersebut, tapi juga merupakan sebuah kewajiban bagi para generasi penerus dan juga merupakan komitmen para politikus politikus dan semua kita untuk mencapai tujuan tersebut, karena kita Sekali lagi, sekali lagi untuk mencapai hal yang disebutkan di atas, sekali lagi harus dicanangkan kerjasama di bidang ekonomi. Um, uh, at the 
least nine uh, technical ministers for doing reduction of the emission in uh, this sector. Uh, we said in the national level also we um, uh, also we uh, set up the local action plan in the 33 provinces. Natural forest loss and economic growth 